and tip. Swag, drip, swag. What am I? Money, big bags. What am I? Hottest clips, stash. What am I? Stunt, big splash. Drip, swag, drip, swag. What am I? Money, big bags. I know bags. the truth that I'm lying to myself. I took my head up out the clouds. This ain't a battle for the crown. It's me taking out the old dog just to put him down. Oh, having oh, a, me, having so a mediocre record and still hustling is not doing big things. You seven and seven, still Jack and Coke, and I'm not talking mixed drinks. Why they call you Buzz the Animal? Why they call you Buzz the Animal? Is it the animal instincts, or is it the fact that every battle Buzz the Animal instincts? I mean, I think you got me and Buzz the Animal confused. I'm carnivorous, what type of animal are you? I'm a rapper in the tooth, I'm a fucking antlers of a moose, I'm a mammoth on the loose, you're a panda at the zoo, I'll leave the animal extinct, I'll leave the animal extinct, the perfect adjective for you, call animal rescue the way I'm handling this dude, I will smack him with a shoe, with my hand or with the boot, call the ASPCA, this shit is animal abuse. <laughs> You are addicted to steaks if we're talking life on the strip. We would need a whole tray to put ice on your wrist, and your fingers are too fat so you fucking type with a stick. But... <laughs> but fuck jokes. I'll use reality to show that they're lame. The joke would be, you probably need two seats whenever you sit on an airplane. <laughs> the reality would be, if you sat next to me on an airplane, it wouldn't ruin my night, it wouldn't ruin my flight, it would ruin my life. <laughs> His coming down this, him coming down the aisle with hard steps and short breath. Please, God, don't let him sit here. I'd be praying with palms clenched. Sit down and you're drenched from your breast to your forehead. Fuck two seats. Lard fest could only fit a park bench. In case of emergency landing, he'd need an extra large vest. If he has the window seat, the sun's eclipsed by your chest. And I'd be hard pressed. I'd be hard pressed to stay meta like our test. Cause this guy can't keep his side fat off of the armrest. I mean. Last title match, watch it back. Shit is weird, like if you can't handle that angle then switch careers, that's like a boxer before the fight saying, listen clear, set some limits here. If I get backed in the corner, stop the bout, interfere, and whatever happens, he is not allowed to hit me here. <laughs> That shit exposed your inner fear. Now I feel like I'm in the whip, switching gears, switching lanes when I steer, watching that battle in the mirror. Cause looking back, it was closer than it appeared. <laughs> and the way you lick your lips is weird. <laughs> we seen your true colors when sabotaging Sharon, how you expose others' weaknesses while camouflaging your own. Like, he used to bully his opponents. That's the way that Pat won. But when he picked on Nils, I was taking back some. Then Calico pulled the same exact stunt, pushed his face, his hat spun, and you ain't pay him back none. That was the first time we seen the champ kind like Anchorman won. I mean... <laughs> Nah, you know what? Fuck that. You kept it professional. I respect it. I dig it. We all know Pat's a real dude, because he tells us every five minutes. I mean, we get it. We get it. <laughs> but you know who don't have to say they a real motherfucker? A real motherfucker? Ain't you the same cat that wet Willie Jimmy and picked up Nils, motherfucker? Then you in the ring with Calico and shit's getting real, motherfucker. All of a sudden, you want to be professional for real, motherfucker? <laughs> what you gonna do now? Moonwalk with steel toe boots on? <laughs> It's 2015, who the fuck moonwalks and why are you wearing steel toe boots, dog? <laughs> I mean, am I the only one that thinks this? I mean, what's next? You gonna make sure your Skechers tie before you electric slide? <laughs> that ain't swag, Pat. <laughs> that ain't swag. You little fucking, little fucking swagget. Yo. <laughs> I, I know, I know you cheering Pat on. In fact, y'all should be. And I can take that ill will, like Smack won't book me, but... But you know what you have in common with Cassius Boxing? Getting your title stripped, but it ain't the draft you dodging, it's these jabs I'm tossing. You think Pat gonna cook me? 
It's like if you had the option to smash a broad, but had to ask Magic Johnson if he had a condom. You got to pass on, pussy. Pat's all bully bully till Pat got bullied. His character switched poorly. Marvel vs. Capcom rookies, I'm past y'all. Besides, how you scared of Corey and you like 6'5 even? I was on your side, bitch, till I seen how he gets by cheating. Now try to calm me on wildin' out, cause from the clips I'm seeing, I'm in danger, cause Chill ain't the only one that wins by scheming. We are not the same. You playing, you make my ears pop. I make top tears, drop tears, and drop tears after him. I have to get a tip. Buddy, fucking, are you fucking, is this one of you? Ooh, I had a clear shot like Smirnoff. Should have smacked him upside his head, made a tilt like he's getting an eardrop. I'm sick of. See, my style's magnificent, swag dripping. I'm way too smooth, y'all. The white Snoop Dogg. I can moonwalk with steel toed boots on. <laughs> He's right there. Cool. Well, off the head, man. He just creeping up to you like some type of obsessed fan. He's right the fuck there. This dude's still your friend. Damn. If that was me, zombie would be a walking dead man. Cause static that be cutting up your phone line. You looking for a problem, then you struck a fucking gold mine. Roll by slow in a bucket, got a full five clip to your neck like you button up a bow tie. Bitch, fuck race, I discriminate all. You're hitting the jaw, your chin will just fall like a ventriloquist doll. I'll leave a hole with your fa- Like, hey, you're hitting the jaw, your chin will just fall like a ventriloquist doll. I'll leave a hole with your faces like you getting a massage and turn you into the next prince like kissing a frog. Yo, and if that don't finish the job, and somehow you survive it, I'm back at you. Shooting through the side of your Uber drive. I don't care if you scuba diving, I'll toss a bomb and nuke the island. If you're flying, first episode, I'll shoot the pilot. Hey, hold up. Every day, gonna put on that tough mood. God, that must bug you. His moms be like, love you. He'd be like, whatever, fuck you. <laughs> Aside from that shit, you're a has-been. You'll never get signed rapping. You're the most annoying shit to pop up on the neck since live Jasmine. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Calico. Yeah, that's right. Suck my dick and shut the fuck up. But see me, I have no front. And I don't need to drop names to raise mine, I have no crutch. You push weight with the same set your dad throws up, but got no rep without him spotting you. Yeah, rack those up. Push yeah. Yeah. Back on yeah. up. Yeah. I pack those punches that'll make your chest and backbone touch. Collapse both lungs, attack mode. Cut you in half with the exacto gut like a mackerel and just pick through him like an afro puff. If you was a real dude, you wouldn't have to act so tough. If you really trapped so much, you wouldn't open your trap so much. <laughs> Applying fear like a 4-4 four -four or a hawk in your mouth when somebody forces you to withdraw an amount more than a mortgage and house up in your storage account. <laughs> I am fear. Like walking towards that like zombie corpse on the ground after you've used all of your rounds and you're not sure if it's down. Yes! You are scared. It's unfair. That's why he has to bring his mates to portray his son John Gotti. But our name says it all. He needs an arsenal and I just need that one shot. <laughs> but don't talk about guns here, Sancho. <laughs> Last in session, the rule is back with straight lines for drastic measures, your casket's measured. Practice makes perfect. Well, I practice to the point where it's past perfection. I'm just battling my past perfections. They said practice what you preach. But I don't preach, you can ask the reverend. It's been a minute since I asked for blessings in my last confession. I don't preach, I teach. And I've got pupils that'll look you in your pupils and raise arms like they're asking questions, but they don't ask me. 
They don't ask me questions. You need to give a man of my class room. Stay back like you have detention. You can't take away from us. That means try with those heavy hands. It's metal bands, because that'll be your death tone. You got writer's block. I came to write on blocks. I'm talking about your headstone. You got away with killing words. I got away with killing rappers like Shook Knight and Death Row. So give the Lord. So give the Lord salute. Sorry, it's all tune. We'll give T pain and correct tone. There's levels to this shit. Different zones, the distance shows. If this is a race, I don't mean race. We're just different tone. How are you still champ? You got beat off our deaf Chris and Osh. I don't see T in that picture unless it's with Kermit, but that's none of my business though. I do not trust you, Charlie. You have the same face as your dad. I want to put a round of shells on your back because you was raised by a rat. Big killer sleeping a guillotine, a cut above the rest. Oh. I I'm the, I'm the recoil that'll leave your gun hand crushed. True artist, I paint pictures with a drum and brush. I'm the one man band that quest love can't touch. Serve food for thought like the roots front man's lunch. Do you want more? Do you want more? That's why I would like to question. What did you bring to the game? What makes this guy some type of legend? It's working 20 years on this precise, refined impression of Eminem's exact style from 1997. This, this Afghanistan. So you know. I guess so. I'ma take your queen. I'ma come to ice with a knuckle for each feature. Make your eyes roll around in your skull like a speed reader. Stallone in a beef freezer, holding a meat cleaver. Street sweeper suited up with the mask of a beekeeper. You was the big fish in this pond, but we see deeper. Can't run with the wolves, cause you only the sheep's leader. The bars you go to war with ain't even unique either. The source is the original. You're just a repeater. You see, Peter's like. It's a present, what I'm giving you is a gift. Wasn't for me, half of these fans would have never knew you exist. And I get it, I get it. Being a little dude is a bitch, but it's better to just accept it. Those are the biggest shoes you could fit. When I first met him, when I first met him, I was thinking, whoa, this middle schooler can spit. But we all hoped he'd grow up to be a little cooler than this. Your fans blow, I blame it on their conditioning. Cause dude on his stage, jumping through hoops, rocking them Fugazi J's, isn't sick enough to influence the game. You not the real air, your soul showed us truth. You a fake who ain't authentic enough to step in the shoes of the great, but those are actually new. And I'm kind of matching you, but mine are classic, so I'm winning in this fashion too. I'll snatch your shoes, I'll snatch your, I'll, I'll snatch your shoes. No. Nitty don't ride dolo, he be hopping crew to crew So who are you to try solo? I'm the wrong one The fool with what you're doing isn't smart rum Special Olympics, track and field This is stupid in the long run Get ignorant and a couple dumb dumbs will leave your wig split Then I unload even more on whoever knit wit Retard! <laughs> Was barely running as a youngin', but I picked up the pace. Kept the moving, never mentioned a break. So we started turning up and into something, then depicted as great. We on a journey like the Indian face.